Welcome back, everybody. Okay, so um, this video is going to be pretty short. I'm very excited about this, and I wanted to make a video about it. And um, yeah, so uh, before I do this, let me just tell you a little, a little bit of backstory on why I'm doing this. Um, for the past few years, I have been uh, a part of a project called Super Science Showcase. I've talked about it a couple of times on the channel before, but have never really drawn too much attention to it because there's not a ton out there about it. They're still producing and creating everything, all right? Um, but I'm a, one of the main characters. There's quite a few main characters. It's like an ensemble cast. Um, but it's supposed to be like educational, family-friendly content. Uh, it's, there's some comedy in there. There's some heavy material. There's all types of stuff. Uh, there's something for everyone, in my opinion. Uh, in Super Science Showcase. Now, we've created some shorts so far, and we have a lot of stuff like in the pipeline that has not yet come out. But a while ago, director and writer and, you know, producer Lee Fanning had us all come on the set, and we made a feature-length film. This film is called The Shock Losers Survive Camp Analog. Um, this film has been in post-production for, or is it post-production? Is that, is that what it's called? I think that's what it's called. For a very long time. Um, and just, I don't know exactly, let me see, when did this come out? Came out today. I found out about this like five minutes ago, and I was like, before I watch it, I, I think I should react to it. Um, so, I'm very excited about this. The final trailer just came out. And I want to watch it. I want to show you guys. And uh, I'm going to ask you if you want. There's going to be a link down in the description to the original video. Check it out. There's a few other videos on the channel that you might be interested in. Um, consider subscribing to their YouTube channel, going onto that video and liking it, or just giving it a view. Just, uh, you know, boost it in the algorithm. If you want, you don't have to, but I'd appreciate it. And, oh boy, I'm really excited about this because... Um, yeah, I've been wanting to see this for a long time. Not the trailer, the actual movie, but I am uh, also excited to see the trailer. So, without anything else to say, uh, thank you for joining me. Um, I'm assuming not a million people are going to watch this video. I don't really know what I'm going to title it. But if you're here, thank you. I appreciate you. Let's, uh, let's check this out. The Shock Losers of Five Camp Analog 2021 feature film trailer Family adventure drama. Let me give it a thumbs up. Here we go. So what do you guys make at this place where we're going? Camp Analog. Yeah, it's, no phones. Uh, what? I don't know. We're so freaking young. This was this was filmed uh, multiple years ago. Um. I made a lot of friends on set for this. Uh, so there's Hunter Flanagan, who I've reacted to one of his songs. He's a, a musician, you know. Um, I think Luke Luke Partridge has also released music. Um, and I played D&D &D with Ryan a lot, you know. Like, uh, yeah, there, there's a lot of people on here um, that I've stayed in touch with afterwards. So it's very interesting to see us all when we were... A lot younger. Um, but yeah, uh, it's very dramatic so far. I like it. Let's keep going. I don't want to talk too much about the plot. I don't want to spoil anything for anyone because I'm hoping that you guys will see the movie when it comes out. But let's keep going. So what do you guys make at this place where we're going? Camp Analog. Yeah, it's... Uh... What? I don't know. It's creepy. Yeah. Camp Analog isn't all no that wi -Fi. different from the normal run-of-the-mill summer camp. We're just trying to cut the crap, right? Get back to basics. Director Suggs has a really wise philosophy. Everything here is real. And the only way you're going to understand that is if you're completely unplugged. What this tells you? That you are more important than everyone else in the world. But that's not what life is supposed to be. This isn't a summer camp. It's, it's a brainwashing, brainwashing program. program. Yep. No Resist. Escape. 
Doesn't that look familiar? Contraband. You three are on thin ice. For one more stunt like that, you'll be on the training squad for the rest of the session. That was all my stuff. My clothes, my toothbrush, my crochet hooks. It's a dying art, I'm not ashamed of it. Most of us are here because we are... It's a dying art, I'm not ashamed of it. Yeah. Um... Trailer's really well done so far. I like it. Um... Yeah, when uh, we saw a screening of, like, a version of the film before it was finished. And there was a layer to it that I did not expect there to be. And it, w it was really interesting and added another uh, aspect to the movie. Where the music and the way everything was shot at a, at a few key points made it a lot more dramatic. You know? Like, it juxtaposes uh, comedy and the educational value with super dramatic and almost uh, dark, not really dark, but very interesting uh, choices made by um, Lee. And I really liked it. It's really cool. Like how the music in the background, when they start to realize that it's a brainwashing program and all that. Um, but then there's a lot of positive and important messages throughout the entire thing. Uh, yeah, let's keep going. We appreciate what this place is about, which means if you don't get in line, you're not just going to have trouble from the director. What are you trying to prove? I'm not trying to prove anything. I'm just trying to be myself. You're just trying to be so cool. Everyone can tell. We always have hodos who don't associate with my daughter. You know, I like it being co-ed and all, but he seems a little eager. It's not just that he won't listen. He doesn't want anyone else to listen either. That's dangerous. We've got to squash it. Bite the bullet. Put your head down and just go with the flow. It'll be the easiest. And I got friends who are starting to become drones because they don't know they can be themselves while everyone else being against them. <laughs> Sucks thinks that if we are who we really are, then all we're capable of is caring about ourselves. So are we really what Sucks says we are, or are we better? Alone, man. I am the. Uh, At least I'm real. Maybe we really don't think much for ourselves. Aren't you going to do anything? The therapist says I should stay out of other people's business. For your emotional well-being. No, because the arm. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Superscienceshowcase.com. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. The comments are turned off. Dang it. I would have commented beneath it. Since the comments are turned off on there, comment below what you thought. Um, and, um, yeah, like I said, it's supposed to be uh, family-friendly educational content. Uh, I'm so excited to see the feature-length thing. Um I almost wish I could do a reaction to it, but I pro I really can't. So let me think. What what could I do? Hmm. I'll think about that. But uh, yeah. Uh, if you want, go. Oh, okay, that's why. That's why the comments are turned off. It's set as made for kids. All right. Um, if you want, go subscribe to Super Science Showcase the YouTube channel. They currently have eighty-seven subscribers. Let's see if we can get them to over a hundred. Right. Um. You guys are awesome. Thank you for watching this with me, if you did. I appreciate it. I'm very excited to see this. Uh, I might be heading to set this week for something totally different, so um, not sure exactly how many reaction videos I'll be able to make. Um, but on a positive note, the dual enrollment side of school is almost finished for this um, semester because everything's accelerated, like I've mentioned before. Uh, I might try to take one more class during spring, I don't know, uh, specifically dual enrolled, which for anyone who doesn't know, that means I'm taking college courses <laughs> online while also um, while also doing normal high school. So I'm getting, you know, college credit. Uh, yeah. Anyway, so the point of that, me telling you that, is that aspect is almost done until the end of the summer. 
which will mean I'll be able to make a lot more uh, videos and focus a lot more on YouTube and making content for everybody and experiencing lots of great music. So uh, thank you very much for all of your support. Just hang in there a little bit longer. I'm going to try to keep on uploading as often as I can until we make it to that that point where I think I'll be able to, you know, start mass producing again, you know. Um, but yeah, so... I don't want to say too much about this because, first of all, my opinion's probably biased because I'm in it. A lot of my friends are in it, and it's a passion project because of how awesome it is. And it was probably the first thing that I really got into as any major part, so I will always be attached to it. Um, let me see. What else is on their YouTube page? Um, there are other things that you could watch on there. There's a few other trailers for other things that have also not yet come out. Um, there's a link to their official site, to their, uh, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Uh, let's see what else. <laughs> I made a book review for them. Uh, some of the other actors did as well. So there's, there's lots of short videos you could check out if you wanted to. And, um, I also don't want to talk about the plot too much because it would, it could spoil the film. But let's just say that a bunch of kids make a mistake <laughs> uh, while they're on the internet. We all have a YouTube channel that we upload to, and we're sent away to a camp where we're going to be reformed to the, to the true way of living. And there's almost a dual meet message behind the entire film, where there's one side where you know, the <laughs> you have to find a balance between these two extremes, basically. Um, but I can't really say anything past that. So, uh, yeah, the the subject matter, in my opinion, is a is while the film itself is a family friendly, you know, kid friendly con uh, educational film, there are undercurrents in there that I remember thinking were, wow, these are pretty. These are pretty deep. These are interesting. So hidden within this film, there is lots of stuff that I think adults could at least find interesting as well. Um, but anyway, thank you for watching. Um, and yeah, stay tuned for more reactions. Again, stay tuned for Moody Blues. I've got the tab pulled up. I am going to be doing it. Um, and then the other two that were the other two albums that were in the poll. And then we're moving on. All right. And we'll do some rush soon. And yeah. Peace, my friends. Stay safe out there. We are Legion. I'll see you all very soon.